Hello and welcome back to Sidemen React. Today we are venturing inside the life of Dubai's billionaire kid. Is this Money Kicks? I should expect so. Because yeah, Money um, Kicks is fighting on Anthony Joshua's card tomorrow. Yeah, night. that yeah. is insane. So, so he's well, literally. When this video comes out a little while back, so we'll have to see yeah, how that went yeah. down. Well, I can't believe he lost like that. No, nah, he lost <laughs> more like fucking puny kicks. Because <laughs> he's fucking loser. I reckon when we sell sides and XIX and side men, this is gonna be Ethan's kid. No, Inside please, the please, life no, no. of Ethan's <laughs> billionaire kid. No, no, we get it. Billy Vinters is already a billionaire. Some of the richest people in the world. <laughs> But it isn't just adults enjoying the luxury available in the UAE city. That's the kids I ever are also smashing out their fortune. I shit there. myself, but it's and cool. one of the most well-known is Rashed Belhasa, also Jeez. known as the face of the YouTube channel Money Kicks. Money. Today we're going to take an in-depth look at Belhasa. We'll see where his fortune comes from, as That's well how as explore the him, strangest and yeah. most expensive yeah. purchases he has made. Including a private I swear he didn't suit have that celebrities tweet. flock to, yeah, yeah, yes. all of a sudden with that up. and supercars wrapped in fashion brands. That so deal. let's get started. The source of Rashed Belhasa's fortune, especially Among during us. his early Among days us. in the vlogging industry, <laughs> that's comes how from he did his it. Construction Among magnate us. father, Saif Ahmed Belhasa. In 2001, he created the company Saif Belhasa Holding. At the time, just one company was under the company's umbrella. Now, there are over 50 companies with over oh. 10,000 employees. According to some sources, at the time of writing, Saif Belhasa's net worth is somewhere between $2.1 billion hell, to $4 oh, wow. billion. I lend us a tenner. Rashed Please, has ambitions bro, to build a financial lend us. Give us empire in his father's <laughs> footsteps. And he might already be there, considering some sources claim his net worth in, at the time What's of writing in? is around three billion dollars. Ah! Fuck. In 2013, <laughs> at around 11 years old, Rashed Belhasa took his first steps into vlogging via Instagram. Not long after, he created the YouTube channel Money you know Kicks to showcase I his expensive that he's lifestyle. Done something. Yeah. Yeah. He could have quite easily just sat there and gone like, "I'm just gonna use the money as I want." He's, yeah, he's actually dumb. made content out of it and stuff like that. You got to be fair, dude. Yeah, I respect too. the hustle. Respect the hustle. At the time of writing, he has 2 million followers on Instagram and 3.09 million subscribers on YouTube. According to reports, oh when he was my. 15, I need this room. Was Bro, out around no. 5, that is a mini minter room if I've ever seen just it. Clothes. Manifest in it, July Simon. 2021, Belhasa took part in social knockout at the got football boots. arena in Dubai. He, he this plays football. boxing tournament had Maybe. YouTubers taking you on... You can Mika sell a sport in the charity match. Belhasa won to. his bout against Anas <laughs> Al-Shaib. While we don't know how much Belhasa made from his boxing debut, in a similar event in June 2020, <laughs> Bryce Hall claims he had a base purse of $5 million. And he, a further he did it. I find that hard to believe. Sure, I don't think anyone got paid as well, that right? That was Various Cap, social course, media yeah. accounts, we get to peek at what Belhasa has splashed that his cash is shit. on. It's also in a really weirdly public spent space. around thirty thousand dollars on a first-class ticket aboard an Emirates Airbus A380 to Los Angeles. Yeah, but I saw Lachlan do that. No, do that. I saw Lachlan do that before. Yeah. Enjoy. <laughs> the suite comes with a mini. That is actually really a little for him. It's chicken change for this man, though. In preparation for his boxing has chicken debut, change actually Belhasa a thing, or has JJ just made it a thing? Clement I think JJ Alberger made it a thing. To design a special mouth guard for the battle. Uh, okay. According to their website, Prochox can create luxury custom mouth guards with prices starting from $10,000. What? Belhasa's guard is made with 18 karat gold and South African what? diamonds and costs $50,000. Sounds like it hurt if you got hit. In 2019, Belhasa decided to get the world's most expensive perfume, Shumuk, by the spirit of Dubai. What makes the perfume special? Because <laughs> you're a schmuck if you buy it. <laughs> of the yeah. It's formed of 3,571 diamonds. Bruh, what's the point? Karat gold, silver, pearls, and topaz also. Bruh. In fact, I mean, it's better than like eating the diamonds or the yeah. gold leaf or whatever. Like, at least you still keep it. Bottle. You know, it's like an yeah, ornament. Even sprays the perfume via what? a remote control. Does it even smell Shemuk nice? Is valued at four point seven hundred and fifty-two million dollars. million dollars. Dirham, or nearly one point three what million is going dollars. On? Belhasa we missed the trick there, perhaps boys. Every kid's That's what I have home. like. It even includes a zoo. Humans in or something. More on that in a bit. Outside the mansion is a swimming pool complete with a waterfall and slide. Under the waterfall is a grotto mansion, where water can spray him. down from the ceiling. While above the waterfall is a jacuzzi where that, you can yeah, relax that, that and take in the views of the garden, 
or just stare down at people in the pool. Also <laughs> outside is a national He's football playing football slash soccer pitch. It even has floodlights for games in the dark. While inside the abode, there's right, a let's come do a football video. Come on. Hide and seek. Let's come do hide and seek. Can we do hide and seek? Link us up. Money kick. Money kick. Just a couple hours, man. Come on. It's enclosed Someone on the property into the in a separate and just area from the main house. Okay, you've lost. <laughs> the zoo, which isn't open to <laughs> the one. public, you is said them. to contain <laughs> over 500 <laughs> animals, you find a trace. <laughs> lions, tigers, giraffes, and many, many more. Many celebrities have visited specifically to see the animals, such as Mariah Carey, Jackie Jeez. Chan, Floyd Mayweather, and numerous football stars. And W2S. And <laughs> W2S. Yeah. It's on his Instagram. Collected zoos. Fun fact. Many of the animals are named after luxury brands, such as Versace the Lion, <laughs> Orangutan's Gucci and Dior, and Armani the Chimp. There are even giraffes named Bert and Ernie. According to experts, building a full-size public zoo can be expensive. Uh, hey, next, Toronto zoo I'm, uh, look, this is what I'm saying. Next million tiger dollars. that they get. Call a big star one, two, three. Just fix <laughs> Why? Just a big star one. Just a big star one. Uh, you know, uh, you picked Bert a lion, Ernie, so I'll you know? go with it. I'll go with it. I'll go with I it. I want to see a big star one, two, three tiger. Around 17.3 million American dollars. Fuck. With inflation, I'll that would be the same open as 117.9 <laughs> million that, Canadian thing? dollars. Or 93 cool, million is. American while feeding the animals each year costs 900,000 okay, no, Canadian not dollars or no, 710,000 American off. dollars. The side zoo's cancelled. Their feeds too expensive. They can cost too expensive. Well. They can <laughs> Eat them sides. dollars for construction alone. <laughs> so we can only imagine the massive price the Belhasa family paid for theirs. Fucking got it on a lead like the walking Bell the dog. Also house is a yeah. room dedicated to his passion for collecting shoes. Money kicks. Necessary considering he has thousands of I pairs. This. Some estimates believe he has over 200,000 shoes. In particular, what? sneakers slash trainers. Ow. Each pair of shoes has its own Those dedicated nice area yeah. to be shown off. Can borrow them for the charity match, lad. In 2017, his <laughs> massive collection was estimated to cost around one million dollars. I, I'm trying to be like pairs you, is the man. 2004 to be like Air kit, Jordan yeah. 13, signed by Michael Jordan himself. Ooh, that's According quite cool. According to Belhasa, in 2016, these shoes were his most expensive purchase when he spent one thousand nine hundred dollars. What? Since that then, like Belhasa has also added a pair of Nike Air Yeezy 2 Red Octave. October to his collection. Jay, you in the Jay past Jay, twelve months, yeah, he's been sold for as much as fifteen. Hey, chicken change, man. What did JJ do with his red Octobers? Well, he had a fake pair that he didn't realize yeah. were fake, and then he got yeah. he bought a real pair because everyone realized that they were fake. Has he still got his real pair? Pro probably not, man. Probably he's the not. kind of person who would throw them out. Yeah, Absolutely, he's, he's, he's that brain. I'm dead. just saying that the shoes I have on my floor right now are more than those ones. Oh, Jeez. money minter. Yeah. Forget yeah. money minter. kicks. And they they might not be signed by Michael Jordan, but they've been looked. At by KSI. But shoes aren't the only He's probably gone. Hobby <laughs> <has>. <laughs> Supercars are also involved. In 2017, he was gifted a Ferrari F12 Berlinetta for his birthday. Gifted. But on top of being I a remember him rapping this. Vehicle, I remember seeing the video. Also wrapped in a Louis I actually, and I like it. Print. I, I like it. Why I like it. Nah, nah, I didn't like the rap. I like it for. I couldn't drive it on the roads. Like it's novelty. In 2017, yeah. the manufacturer's suggested retail price, or MSRP, for the Berlinetta was three hundred nineteen thousand nine hundred and ninety-five dollars. Money cares. I feel like I'm Only not that impressed by this. Later, when he spent one point three on perfume. Ferrari up for yeah. sale with a bargain asking price of around one hundred and ninety thousand dollars. This isn't the only time he's owned custom wrapped luxury vehicles. In 2016, <laughs> hmm. Belhasa also mm, got that a one Cadillac hit, no. Escalade wrapped in no. black and white Yeezy print. Oh, in wow. It's year, literally the a MSRP shoe. for an Escalade was up to $91,950. Literally a shoe. <laughs> like, what car wrap do you want? Make it look like a shoe. Now able to drive on the road, Belhasa decided to splash out. I like that one as well, actually. Honestly. That one's bougie. Donnie's playing GTA. Especially if you wear the Dior fit with the Dior. Oh. Sticking with his love of rapping, yeah, no, that one's this time the fashion brand like Dior had like its logo covering the, yeah, the okay. Belhasa car. Final fact finish. Rashed Belhasa isn't the richest young person in the world. According to Forbes, the wealthiest teenager at the time of writing is Germany's Kevin David Ooh. Lemon. At 19 years old, he currently has a net worth of 3.6 Yo, David, if you're watching this, 
Let's, let's kick it. You can get you on a Sidemen video. You can be on the good company, team. <laughs> David, you look like you love a pint. <laughs> David, come do pub golf hey, he's with German us. as well, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So we can do David, good team, we go team. to Oktoberfest with you, mate. <laughs> yeah, good team, bad team. Good team, hang out with him and, you know. Yeah, we'll promote yeah. One pint, you one pint, David. One pint, David. One pint, please, boy. One pint, David, please. Please, boy. One pint, David.